Bravest by Lou Frazier and Sarah Warburton There's a slumbering hush in the barn on the hill As the stars twinkle down All is calm, all is still No mooing, no neighing, no oinking, no quacking Just rumbling snores And the faint sound of clacking For high in the rafters a small shape is sitting It's Mavis the chicken, click clacking her knitting. Ugh, I'm a bird, Mavis sighed, who finds everything scary, night time and daytime and anything hairy, loud things and fast things and anything whizzy and flying, Whoop, she gulped, makes me feel a bit dizzy. So I think I'll stay here where it's safe near my nest because knitting, she whispered, is what I do best. And so her small needles whizzed clickety clack until clickety clock. Mavis froze. What was that? A flap, then a flutter, and in something flew. <gasps> oh! Mavis gasped in relief. Marge, it's you! Now, Mavis, beamed Marge from her perch in the barn. There's a wonderful world waiting outside this farm. All the adventures we'd have, you and me. If only you'd hop through the door. Then you'd see. But as March softly snored in her feathery bed, Mavis dropped sadly and worried instead. Some chickens, she whispered, are filled to the top, brimming with bravery and courage non-stop. But if there was courage inside me, it's gone. And I can't find the switch that turns bravery on. And once more her needles whizzed clickety-clack. Until clickety ba Mavis froze. What was that? Mavis whispered, is anyone there? As a bear drifted in on the chilly night air. Oh, Mavis gasped, there, there's something outside. What if it's after my knitting? She cried. So, knobbly knees knocking, she crept to the door and smothered a squawk at the sight that she saw. Marge! Mavis shrieked. This is no time to sleep! There's a thief on our farm stealing Sandra the sheep! Don't panic, cried Marge, taking off in a flurry. I'll fetch the farmer, guard Sandra, don't worry. Don't leave me, wailed Mavis, up here on my own, just me and the thief and my scaredness alone. Oh, Mavis, clucked Marge, look again and you'll see. You can be as brave as you wish you could be. But as Marge flapped away, Mavis heard a loud grumbling. <gasps> Uh-oh, she gulped. There's an engine rumbling. That thief's 
stuck our sheep in a truck full of hay and there goes our Sandra. Oh, he's getting away. Oh, I have to do something. Our sheep's been robbed. I'll lose my friend and my wool. <gasps> Mavis sobbed. Oh, please, she whispered. For once could there be just enough brave to save Sandra in me? So she closed her eyes tightly and looked deep inside to check all the places her braveness might hide. And just when she thought it was darker than dark, a flicker of courage appeared like a spark. So she took a deep breath and she dived to the floor. I can save our sheep! And she charged through the door. Into the tractor next, goggles on face, and brrrm! She was off on a wheel spinning chase. Mavis rushed through the meadow. She raced through the field, she roared up the hill till her tractor tires squealed. Oh, Mavis cried, I know just what to do. Click clack went her needles, ta-da, a lasso. Then twirling and whirling, she threw the rope high. Till it twanged round the thief and she pinged through the sky. Clock! Oh! Mavis shrieked as she rocketed up. Then she rocketed down and went plop in the truck. Ah! roared the sheep thief. Take that! Mavis said as she pecked the thief hard on the top of his head. Rumph through the hedge, splash through the stream. Then they screeched to a halt in a great cloud of steam. The farmer came running with Marge by his side. You're a sheep saving thief! Braving Marvel, they cried. Bah, agreed Sandra, and Mavis blushed brightly. Our bravest of hens, Marge said, hugging her tightly. And there, in the star-dusted field, Mavis knew that wherever you go, and whatever you do, when you need it the most, when you're scared or faint-hearted, you can find the switch that gets bravery started. For no matter how fearful or feathery or small, there's a spark of braveness inside us all. Thanks for watching Love to Read with Miss Ellis. Please remember to like, subscribe and comment. Take care. Bye for now.